Today's video will teach you how to download and make your own custom graph in RAW Excel so you can get the perfect sensitivity for Valorant. If you didn't know, RAW Excel is a third party software that is improved by Valorant and basically what it does is it adds mouse acceleration when you're moving your mouse at different speeds and basically what players are doing is they are playing Valorant with really low sensitivities and they are using mouse acceleration to be able to move and flick onto targets like high sense players. Some people are saying that raw XL is bad because it ruins muscle memory as your sensitivity is constantly changing. However, I think raw XL is good because if you get used to it, it could greatly benefit you. I've been using the software for about a week now and I've had pretty positive results. So I'm gonna show you how I made my graph and how you can make your own personal graph. First of all, you want to go into the description and download raw XL. Once it's downloaded, you need to open the folder and install the drivers. Now you need to restart your PC. And once you've done that, you should be able to open raw XL. Now you want to go into Valorant and enter the range. This is now the time you want to change your Valorant sense and create a graph. Choosing your sense is hard because your Valorant sense all depends on what curve you use, but I'd recommend anything between 0.15 to 0.25 and just try to look for a sense in that range which you are comfortable doing tracking and micro adjustments. Personally, I found 0.23 to be the most comfortable for me. However, if you're unsure for what sense to use, then you can just use 0.2 as a base sensitivity and you can change it in the future if needed. Now I'm gonna tell you what everything means and does in raw Excel so you can create a graph for yourself. So acceleration is how steep you want the graph to be. Cap output is your sense multiplier and input offset is how much you have to move your mouse until it starts to increase the sensitivity. So I'm going to give you two graphs to start out with and then you can try them both and tweak it to your own sense. The first one is linear and the second one is classic. Try them both out and see what they feel like. Right, so I'm just gonna test one out in game and I'm just gonna copy all the stuff right now. Your graph should look something like this if you copied out the classic one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into the range and use my 0.23 cents. I'm gonna just try this graph out and see how it feels. So the micro adjustments feel a bit weird. So I'm gonna go into the diffuse or practice and see how easy it is to clear corners. And I think this is where the input offset becomes bad if you have it high because when you're trying to clear a site, you're not moving your mouse much and it's really hard to have good crosshair placement when your sense is really low. Like, because I'm clearing like one at a time, sense is really slow right here because I'm not moving that much, which sometimes can be bad. So I'm actually gonna change my input offset to a bit lower. So I'm gonna change my input offset to about two and maybe change my acceleration. I might try something like this. Feels a lot faster. Yeah, I feel like I've got a lot more control now. You can use this diffusal practice to test like real in-game scenarios and then you can pretty much go from there. Obviously, if I wanted this a bit slower, but I still wanted it to be this fast, all I've got to do is now just change this to 0.2 and I've still got a slow thing. It's actually harder to turn. It's obviously, my sense is lower. So all you've got to do, obviously, you cap output, which is your sensitivity multiplier, basically. You can just increase that and now it's gonna almost two times your sense when one year right up here and now got a really slow sense and then i still got high when i move now i've got a really low sense on my presser which is actually making it too hard i think and this is too slow for me yeah it's too low so now we do like maybe in the middle so we go one two five. Yeah, like this is way better. This is something I definitely use now. Hopefully, now you should have a good understanding of raw Excel and a good sensitivity that suits you. I'd recommend keep playing around with it and just keep trying different things. If you need any help, just contact me on Discord, which is in the description. It's been your boy Critical. Peace out.